I want to be climate sensitive, and I think most farmers do, most people do. I'm John Harrison, owner of Sweetwater Valley Farm. All of life depends on the top six inches of the soil. My name is Alexander Young, and I'm the sixth generation uh, farming row crops in southwestern Kentucky and Christian County. We just have to farm in a way that allows the biology in the soil to flourish. Our soil is our largest resource, and we have to protect it. Have to. I'm Mike Beam. I'm Joe Beam, and our farm is Beam Springs. I do this for the challenge, I do this for the desire, and I do this for, for human health. We are sequestering carbon, and we are eliminating the release of CO2 into the atmosphere. I don't know how you can get any better for the, for the environment. Rick Clark, Clark Land and Cattle, fifth generation from West Central Indiana. Anytime that we can take carbon from the atmosphere and put it in our soils, that's a good thing for farming and it ends up being a good thing for the environment. You're taking care of the crop and you're affecting the soil, but the fact that it touches the entire ecosystem is amazing to me. It's an entire chain that leads back to, as I said, back to the top six inches of earth. And now you've got this fuel, the food for the corn, the fuel and the food for the microbes. It's all being done right here. This is exactly what building soil health is all about. This is the epitome of farming green and regenerative organic stewardship. So what my goal has been is to educate and basically just be transparent. What we do, why we do it. I mean, we're basically in the energy business. We're growing energy to produce food. That's what we're doing, and food's energy. So we've been in the energy business. That first dairy is out there trying to be carbon neutral. Most farmers want to leave the farm as well or better than they found it. So I think we've been doing that for a long time. I'm making a difference for the world by producing food in a responsible way. It is amazing to see the family legacy of stewardship and responsible production of food and know that we are not just maintaining things for a future generation, but we're actually improving our farm and our land for future generations.